everybody, welcome back to Taz's Wig Closet. This is Taz. Today I'm going to present one of the newest styles by John Renault, new for 2019 spring. This is Gabrielle in the color Malibu Blonde, which is 12 FS12. I've received this wig from Andrea at Wig Studio One for this review. Uh, be sure to go out to Wig Studio One to find this wig, all of the other John Renault styles, and much more. Wig Studio One also sponsors a private Facebook group. You can find it by searching Wig Studio One Wigs and Topper Support Group. So Gabrielle is a really heavily layered short bob cut. Let's go ahead and go through the specs. So the front piece here is about 5.75. Now that's probably going to reach down to about the bottom of my lip because I'm about 7 inches from hairline to chin. We have about a 5.75 inch crown layer, a 2.75 inch nape, and then there's a very unique 4 inch side layer here which actually stretches out behind the ear as well. A temple to temple hand tied lace front, one of John Renault's smart lace fronts. They use a welded material which makes it extra strong and very pliable. It's a single monofilament top and then a hand tied cap. So you'll find a monofilament base with cluster knots and then um, it is covered by a nice mesh material and I'll show you the cap here pretty soon. So let's go ahead and take a look at this lace front. So the knots are done very well. This new 12FS12 color has a little bit of a lighter root than the 12FS8 and combined with these very fine fibers it gives a very nice knotting effect there. And then you've got your single, single monofilament top, very easy to see through to the illusion of scalp. In fact anywhere throughout this cap you're going to be able to get the illusion of scalp due to that monofilament base. The John Renault 12 FS12 is one of their brand new blondes in the California Blondes collection released in 2008. Um, it is a light brown base and you'll find some light brown at the, at the base of the nape especially. You've got some medium gold blonde and then some very pale gold blonde highlights. All of that is on a light brown root. I think all of that is true. I think that this color is very warm. It seems warmer to me than the Sister Color 12 FS8. You will find that the layers on Gabrielle, especially in the front and on the side, they kind of have an inward swept movement, um, as I mentioned, and it kind of comes to a point right there if you follow the grain of the fibers. You're not going to get much lift and volume on this style just because it is completely hand tied. There's no permatease at all on this style. But the way the stacking is done in the back, you will see a little bit of profile here with an ample nape. There's no permatease and the uh, fibers are extremely dry and fine. Now when I say dry, I just mean very baby fine. They actually feel very silky, like spun silk. And because of these very fine fibers, they're not real what I would like to call impressionable. Sometimes you can get nice layered bobs where you can kind of move the fibers around and get some spikiness and bring out a lot of texture. You're not going to be able to achieve that with this style unless you have a styling product. I recommend John Renault's uh, Contour Fiber Cream and you can heat some up in your hands and start at the root and just really bring out the layering and the texture of this wig. And that also goes for the density. It's a very light density. This wig only weighs 1.8 ounces. Imagine that. It's a completely hand tied cap with lace front monofilament and only weighs 1.8 ounces. This is one hand tied wig that I think you can deal with in a warm weather climate or in the summertime. A lot of the hand tied wigs kind of trap heat and so forth, but because this one is so lightweight, I really think it's going to be a good option for, uh, for summer.
here's an inside look at the cap for Gabrielle. Again, it only weighs 1.8 ounces. It's, it's just as lightweight as I've ever felt a wig. You have the temple to temple lace front. Uh, a seam joins the lace front to the single monofilament top. All the seams are velvet lined. You have a nice ear tab here. It's closed velvet lined. There's an extended velvet nape and Velcro adjusters. Here's your monofilament base covered with a beautiful mesh material. It's very comfortable and see-through. There's not a lot of stretch on this style. It's average size right out of the box and I had to cinch it in a lot to accommodate my petite average circumference. I suggest that if you have a circumference below 22 that you would buy the petite size. So I'm happy to report uh, that based on the fact that there's no permatease and a very slim ear tab here, uh, you can easily rest your glasses right on the ear without any problem. One of the main things with your styling here is going to be, aside from some accessories, and we'll get into that, is the fact that you can move around this part wherever you want. And I really like that option with a shorter wig because with shorter wigs, sometimes you don't have as many versatile styling options as you might with a longer style. So you could even take a really wide part. Again, I definitely would be using some uh, fiber cream or styling cream just to help hold the shape of your style uh, with these fine fibers. Thanks for joining me for this review of the brand new John Renault Gabrielle in the color Malibu Blonde 12 FS12. See you next time on Taz's Wig Closet.